It's been two weeks since the lives of a mother and her two children were claimed by a tragic fire. This for Jelena Martinez shows us the efforts that are being taken to prevent fire accidents like this one and how one precinct is giving away free smoke alarms. Well, I'm going to feel much happier because we got two granddaughters and we'll feel more. This is my wife here. We'll feel more secure. Me siento muy, sobre todo la plática que te dieron es muy importante porque ya soy preparada y sé cómo explicarles para que son los detectores de humo y animar a la comunidad que tenga uno. Before the free smoke alarms were distributed, residents sat through an installation and fire safety training with Red Cross. The cost and installation of fire alarms was one of the biggest reasons why residents never had them in the first place. They're kind of expensive and we don't even know how to install them. The, the other ones were electricity and they cost money. Pero no miraba la importancia de tener una alarma. A lot of people live in mobile homes. And in most of the uh, families, they don't, don't, don't know about smoke detectors. The fire alarms headed to residents today are very easy to install. First, you have to place the base of the alarm on a wall, nail it down with two bolts, and then place the main alarm right on top. You should turn it and hear a click. A lot of the community is re obviously realizing uh, that it plays a fundamental key role in assuring that we give a significant warning to any potential fire. As Commissioner Joseph Palacios continues to advocate for fire protection, residents are taking what they learned today and spreading awareness. I came to pick up the smoke detectors for my neighbors. Pues que la comunidad, uh, si llega a tener una alarma, siempre se esté consciente de que tenga la batería y que no se las quite porque es como si no tuviera. In San Carlos, with complete Valley coverage, Jolani Martinez, CBS4, Valley at 6. If you're interested in obtaining a fire alarm, you can visit the San Carlos Community Resource Center.